Oh, okay, well. This part with this part is so awkward. I actually think a lot of the effects could have been done as a uh, paper effects. There's a pretty big burden on the players to like track stuff like this, but it is doable, I think. Like the same way that, uh, what's, what's the white crater thingy that you would reveal at the start of a game? Like that one, where it's like, you can't play a spell. Or when you play a spell, the next one costs one more where it's countered. It's like this sort of thing, right? I've played a little on my phone at a... Oh, you got screw by chance on testing. Sheesh! Yo, this thing's bigger than a frostbite? I mean, come on, tell me that isn't just exciting. Blue Red Gamer? You figured out Lear and uh, Holbreaker Horror is good? Innovator? Icon the moment? I just want to play this because it's not like we get that much by holding it. Look through, oh no, that's brutal. I played a local thing where my opponent went like, reveal a chancellor, unmask myself, attempt to reanimate it like a grizzle brand. And I had to like force, have my force get countered and surgical the grizzle brand. And I was like, holy cow, I got so lucky to have stuff to do there. <laughs> How much is this? It's four mana to make it deal plus one more. I have to draw a card. I'm not gonna try to put Leer in play. Six, go to eight, better have this. Okay. Play your leer. Do your worst. Oh, gold span dragon. I have not heard of them. Imagine if we had infernal grasp. Imagine. I respect it. I like to go blanks. I think against everything I saw there. Maybe I like the snake skin rails. This card, uh, Rahilda, I think is how you say that. I kind of, she's kind of crazy. She's like robber of the rich for werewolves. Uh, why is it making all the cards big all the time? Do I do it like this? Huh, whatever. Yeah, the puppy was unstoppable there. Did y'all see that? I think I'm gonna leave two of these in. Cause I do need like a way to kill a Leer or a dragon. No, 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 the the one drop is you gain a life and then the next creature you play gets a plus one, plus one counter and also gets a trample and vigilance counter. So it just like turns your creatures into like beefy boys. Oh, the mystical archive. Oh, that's snakeskin veil. Yeah, it makes them thick, Manda. Look at that face though. I made, I made an emote for the puppy. I need to make it a little bigger, and like I need to work on it a little more. But look how cute he is. Look how cute he is. I love that little guy. That's my boy, I'd do anything for him. <laughs> for I've only had him a few minutes. You think if I attack the block? It's, <laughs> oh wow, blocking day one in alchemy confident in their knowledge of the cards. I don't know if I would. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, thanks, Bob. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I never should have made that joke in Twitch chat. That was, uh... You know what? I'm not engaged. What does this do now? It's flipped again? It's a werewolf lord. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm 6 and single. I, I would never get it, uh, engaged after one day. I'm not that down bad. Huh. 
We can Shatter Skull smashing that egg now. I kind of want to... Yeah, I'm going to kill this thing. I mean, it probably just eats like a Gerard's disruption or something. But I, I think that egg is like a way for them to actually win. I think I'm just going to play class level up. It like kind of sucks to not oh, like open up the door to do this or like this plus go blank. I guess I'm going to up the pup. No, I should have been in green. Whatever. Bam, bam. I guess this thing is also a 5-5, five five, but we just get to play it from hand next turn almost assuredly as the big one. Burn down the house. Alright. Please do not have Jawari's disruption. For I have a 5-5 five five that I would like to make a 6-6. Six six. Uh, Summit 0. Bam. Target up to one planeswalker? Wait. Why is it letting me target them? Oh, it's target player or planeswalker. Okay. Yeah. Let's get this. No, oh, I forgot the pain. <laughs> oh wow, my green screen's messed up again. I'm so mad. <laughs> I like tested this earlier, like even on this map, and it wasn't doing this. Uh, not today, but I will definitely be doing it. Uh, part. This card's so cool. Uh, I'm going. To, I I love historic. And I love the idea of alchemy, so I'm going to be streaming a bunch of these formats. I'm going to focus just on alchemy for a while. We might do some historic near the back end of the stream, but I think for like today and tomorrow, alchemy only. We'll look into some historic stuff later. But I have a couple really cool deck, I think cool decks, that I want to play in that format. So, well, this is a three one, and this is a three three. Yeah, I, I had I had done the thing where it was working and not being a problem. And there was like no you none know, of the fuzzy us. But I don't know if I changed something. I mean I obviously changed something. But I, I don't know what I what I did change to make it happen. Let's level this up using green green. Yeah, I'm too tall. I actually cast too tall of a shadow. If I was less handsome and shorter, this would not be a problem. Oh, I don't think it actually matters, but make sure. This card is so sick. Like, it's so hard to beat this thing. Like in creature matchups, but maybe we're supposed to sideboard this and just play Rahilda. Or Rahilda, I don't actually know. Oh, the, the white card that's Collected Company? I want to build a deck with that tonight, too. And this one's the, the wedding thing? Okay. White card now. Alright, pup pup, get big. Wolf, get big. Um. Huh. That's interesting. All right.
Yo, this... <laughs> the puppy, even in death, has our back. Oh! Is that the one that was created? Can it, does it tell me? Yeah, this is the created card. This is A22 on it. Does combat damage to a player. Okay, so this, is, this does combat damage. I think there's a four and I force a trade. I kind of want to put this into play. Because like, we put this into play, we get to put both of these into play on the next turn. Yeah, let's, let's attack for four and see what happens. I love the art on this, but they're like, oh, we've been invited. <laughs> what what a great <laughs> what a great event. <laughs> the Hal Pack Piper of the time is now. Ooh, Lalith the Spider Queen. That card's messed up. Yeah, you got some spiders. It'd be a shame if I put, I don't know, let's say nine mana worth of permanence into play. And made it nighttime. That would suck. I kinda just wanna attack with this. I love when it turns to night and the wolves like pop up on the animation. The only problem is the night thing covers up some of your wolves, but. This triggers on in step or the beginning of combat? Okay. There are probably each player sacks a creature here. So what does this say exactly? Other permanent control effects for the beginning of combat put plus on each creature you control. Yeah, I think I want to do that one. Control gets plus zero plus X and trample. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to leave the hexproof growing one. Oh, that was a good draw. At the beginning? Alright, put two counters on each creature you control, okay. I can't believe people ever beat this card in Limited. I just don't... How? <laughs> Like, how do they, how do people ever beat this card? I forgot it was two counters. They don't, they, yeah, I, I guess so. so. Yeah, this and a Chupacabra are the two myths in this world. Oh, they cast it to flip my card. I was like, what is going on? Yo, this Storm Seeker is going to be so big. Yeah, the puppy. Uh, I think the puppy have four. Yeah. So they have to like, block this one and then. All right, well, looks like another Rahilda game because Rahilda is insane. Our opponent did seem a little controlling. Might be a Goblin. We're just in the anime AMV section again. I don't know for a Blood Rage Alpha matchup. God, wasn't that Hal Pack Piper so cool though? <laughs> that was so sick. I think it might just be a kind of a game one y thing though. But wow, it was sweet. Oh, these Infernal Grass kind of suck. I'm being silly. I forgot we had Infernal Grass. Oh. Actually, this might be good. Didn't our opponent have like, yeah, they actually had a bunch of stuff like that. So we'll bring in the Outland Liberator. This pings a lot of the tokens down. Maybe we just want this just to have more bodies and curve. The little fighter. Eh, I'm just actually gonna bring this in. All right, this hand's nice. Cause like Naturalist is funny. Oh wow, they can take my Shatter Skull, right?
Yeah, as long as it's only dead, sure. Dread Fuse. I just got destroyed by that, I guess. Wow. This is a good use of all those AMV things. I got over here on the side, but... That was kind of crazy. I would love to play this Werewolf Pack Leader instead, but... I'm gonna play Big Boy Tovlar and... Draw a card. Oh, well, they had nothing. That's insane. It's actually insane. It's insane in the membrane. This card's so cool. So when you play it, you can put a copy in your hand, and then uh, it to be tap something, and you just does that all the time. So you just like. For one and a white, you can have as many like one and a white as you can pay for. Just dope. I just want Arlen. Make some wolves. Auga. Ow! <laughs> Gotta let them know, you know? Like, if you don't howl, who's gonna howl? Right? Like. Ugh. <laughs> All the cards have a billion text these days. I can't read. <laughs> oh my goodness, they didn't make me sacrifice a pupper. Wow, hang on. This lets me add two mana, right? So now I get to play this and hold up Snakeskin Veil? Yo, this is so dirty. I'm telling y'all, this Jund deck is sick. Deal two damage to... Alright, this thing and this thing. Whatever, you can block my little pupper with your 1-3. Bang, bang. I might come back! <laughs> I wanted I wanted to get a little bit more fun in. Yeah, this deck is sick. Is this black on the back? No, it's the... Seems a little awkward, but I'm keeping. Yo, dress to kill. I love this card's art. It's so good. Need to test more? Sure, sure, sure. Uh, so if we could ban that person, that's not Allie. I've never seen Allie test today in there. <laughs> I kid, I kid. I'm a jokester. Yeah, when you're 6'2", you have bigger things to worry about. There are opponents that can... Oh yeah, I want to put that card into the Omnath deck. That's so sick. Although apparently the card it puts in your hand isn't real. Which is a weird thing to say when talking about magic cards, but that's what Gottlieb said. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you know how I hate the card reflecting pool I realize that whenever I, I see someone play pool on stream I get to do this to them which is like poo L but also pool <laughs> and that brings me a lot of joy <laughs> so they got this teacup at the fairy holy cow that's sick I just want to play this on level. What is this song? Oh, this is Attack on Titan? Never heard of it. You all ever heard of Attack on Titan? But seriously though, I'm pretty excited for this. Second part of the last season of this show. <laughs> Whatever that means. Like. <laughs> Ugh, Omnath. <laughs> I 
Wow, the gain five from Omnath is a little brutal. Now I can have a wolf fight this. Yeah, I'm willing to trade the wolf token for a card. So I can also, if I like hit a land, we can still curve out and Shadow Skull smashing this. Okay. So play the puppy, and then we'll play our wolf that lets our friends fight. And make the friend bigger. And we'll have this fight Omnath. Puppy Pog! We actually have a puppy emote, Jay Shrimp. That is the only reason to subscribe to me is if you are a, a weeb and you like my weeb emotes or the puppy. No other reason. I have had him for five minutes and I will kill for him. <laughs> no, I understand. I'm not saying you need to sub. Whoa. I, I ain't trying to get you dirty like that, friend. I'm just letting you know to let other people know. That's the only reason. <laughs> Uh, you probably want these burning hands, right? Because, like, the thing this makes is green, right? Um, is a haste, toughness. Okay. Oh, it makes the land. Oh, my bad. I thought it made a token. It's probably fine, actually. Is this the same 75 or no shot, right? Maybe it's the same 75. Although this card might not be that good against them. Although, it, I think it's actually this one. It's a little weak and we'll play in two of these. Has anyone here finished Attack on Titan, the manga? Because I have a question that's not a spoiler. Yeah, still single, still looking. So if you know somebody, let them know. I'll keep an eye out. Nice. You're gonna <laughs> walk past <laughs> some attractive lady at a store. Be like, hey, you single? You look like someone that might like this guy that I followed on Twitch, who I follow on Twitter, who is looking for a partner. Uh, you two might be a good fit. So, like, what's what's the team? I think that will go well with them. <laughs> That's so true. How would you like one? Yeah, it's a really flawless plan. It would go really well too. That's for sure. Oh, can they untap that with something? Oh, I think they didn't mean to choose that land. That sucks for them. I feel kind of bad. But we have a couple choices. So we can actually play this and attack for 6, uh, 12. It's probably actually just the play. Because the other drop is like 2 drop Infernal Grasp, which is like fine or whatever. But it's not. It doesn't get me going, you know? Not the same way the Hal Pack Piper does. Oh, I guess the reason they don't flip it in my hand is because the front side matters on the stack. That makes sense. Well, Hal Pack Piper, go forever time. We figured it out, Twitch chat. Renin 6? Or Renin 7? Sorry. That is a lot of things that are quite big. Yeah, it is a lot more. Oh, uh, did I play these all on the... Oh, I had to play this one on the black side. I didn't even realize that I couldn't Inferno Grasp. That's funny. Alright, well... I can, like... I can just do this play. So currently this one will actually kill one of these. 
but maybe I should just, it has menace. I can put them to one and lose my board. I mean, it's gonna kill the, the Ren, right? Which is like the real reason. But is it when it attacks or? Okay, it is when it attacks. So I can buff this one. Yeah, if I buff this one, I always kill. Because I do two to the actual land, two to them and two to Ren. Well, I don't always kill, sorry. Oh, I should have uh, done the token. No, no, actually, it doesn't matter. It's all the same. Yeah, because they just always block the other one. But if I put it on the land, they decide to double block the arsonist, then I actually kill the land, which is better for me. Well... The Averbrook Caretaker. And then we'll put the counter on the Arsonist. If I attack, it doesn't actually do anything, so we'll, we'll wait a turn. Oh, that's a good good top deck. I gotta say, we're feeling the difference in the Omnaps right now, right? Like, draw a card versus Scry here is like night and day. It's like a card they top too. Like, even a land would be pretty good here, right? Like, they gain five life. This one's over red green, okay. Uh, so, if I put a plus one, I can play Ranger class and actually just level it up most of the way, right? Which is maybe the play. I attack with this, I can shoot this or this, and I trade with one of these, which is a little awkward. I guess if I don't do anything this turn, I for sure get the back half, and the back half of my deck is actually so much stronger than the front half. I think it's right. Because I want to buff this one up too, because they're going to both get two counters on the next turn. It's very weird. Yeah, them all getting hexproof too is kind of sick. I forgot that they got hexproof. <laughs> this is so sick. This deck is awesome. Let's go, werewolves. That was a good showing. Did we like. Five and one, we're four and one with the werewolves there.